Away, away, a young fan serenading Packers quarterback Aaron Rodgers as he signed autographs tonight for charity. Fans started lining up early this morning for a chance to meet number 12. Rebecca Clough met one family who almost didn't make it. Christmas came early for so many Packer fans, including a New Jersey couple who flew in just to surprise their son with this experience. A lot of action today at Lambeau Field. Despite the lack of a game, people waited hours to see number 12. 22 hours, got here 8 o'clock last night. I got here at about, from Chicago, I got in town about 145. Left this yes, morning. this morning, yes. The Salvation Army gave the first 200 people the chance to get an autograph from Aaron Rodgers if they donated $100. Well worth it for fans. One was even moved to tears. Because I just met Aaron Rodgers and he signed his helmet. For Melissa Sewer and her family, this was her son's Christmas surprise. They flew in from New Jersey. We got on a plane, we bought the ticket Friday night, I believe it was, and yesterday we were on our way. They didn't tell Emmanuel who he was meeting until this morning. What they didn't expect was how early people would start lining up. They got here at 7, and they were number 201. They were prepared to go home empty-handed until they got a surprise from the man in front of them. He turned around and gave us the last ticket. They say that man drove three hours back to Eau Claire without an autograph, but he gave a little boy his Christmas wish, a chance to get a picture with Aaron Rodgers and hug his hero. It was my wish, um, so like, it finally came true. The Salvation Army has raised more than $22,000, and Aaron Rodgers says he's going to match it. Reporting in Lambeau, Rebecca Clough, today's TMJ4.